Greetings, bad witches and naughty angels. Baronetta here, your host with the most. Right. And today I hope you're ready for the terrors that are in store for us in this episode. We will face the most terrifying creature of them all. Children! Ugh! Truly despicable creatures. Stay tuned for the horrors that await us ahead. Chapter 5 The Lost Holy Grounds. The Sunrise and Crescent Valleys. Or Crescent Valleys, I should say. Yeah, I'm, I'm loving the. Where the hell am I? The Zelda I costume. We could fly a mile for that flight. That concludes our announcement. Sit back, relax, and enjoy your flight. Oh, and let the music play! It's like if Link was a 12 foot glamazon on, walking on the runway. Oh, oh. You wanted a twist, Dark eh? Whip Come Cow! On, season six. Let's get sick, me! Yeah. Thank you so yeah. much for the raid! Yeah, bitch. <laughs> Work. I'm trying out some of the new costumes. I'm loving the I'm loving the Link one so far. I think that's my favorite. Though the Samus one was a nice one as well. I love that one. I love the little nods and references to their games. But for those of you who it might be your first time here, I am Danny. I am one half of Bear Bear Gaming usually stream with my partner, um, but I do have days where I stream on my own sometimes, which is one of those days today, since we're playing a solo game. Playing some Bayonetta 1 here. I have not played this game in years, honestly. But I'm a big Nintendo fan. I love Nintendo. Um, my hubby is more like Sega, PlayStation, but we kind of like bring our stuff together. And he helped me broaden my horizons, and I kind of made him a fan of Nintendo again. So it, it worked out. See, like, doesn't this Link costume look fabulous on her? Oh, I hate these enemies. Get the flock out of here. These are probably one of the enemies I hate fighting the most in this game. Grace and glory. I'll take the glory. Quite naughty. Oh yes, torture attack. Kill it. Kill it with... I was gonna say with fire, but there's no fire involved here. I can never get the last orb. Crushed it. And you get boots. How mama has the boots down. Oh <laughs> that's what I get for doggy shit. There, you take that. I'm loving that I actually have the master sword. Ooh, another LP. Or a piece of one. Okay. I think I might have missed the other pieces of the other one, so I'll go back at some point. But yeah, thank you guys so much for being here, and I know you just came in from your stream um, with dark webcam, so... If you guys need to lurk, go grab some food. I very much appreciate the lurk. Ooh. Oh, come on. It's like I dodged right into it.
Hmm. Huh. My lipstick. She's like, I've been looking forever for this. Nothing. Damn. <laughs> what the? Pass. Jiggy, pass. I've often seen a girl without lipstick, but lipstick without a girl. Most curious, isn't it, Cheshire? What's also most curious is how a child like you has kept afloat in this town. The name is Luca. <laughs> we had a Jigglypuff moment. To be worried about my well-being? Sure, the Festival of Resurrection is peak security. The thing only happens once every 500 years. Can you blame them? Besides, when you look as good as I do, security isn't a problem. A killer like you, on the other hand. I'm sure you found a way. That little girl. I've seen her somewhere. She's like totally not paying attention to Luca. Hey, don't go freaking out on me. We both know you came here for something. But what you don't know is the closer you get, the harder it's going to be for you to get away from me and what you've done. You'll have to fess up to it all. <laughs> I can't wait for you to get your hands on whatever it is you're after. Let me guess. You want to cut? Well, if you're still alive by then, perhaps you can appeal to my generosity. Still alive? You may be standing right in front of me, but you're definitely not living in reality. Which is a shame, because the truth is always going to be the, the truth. truth is nothing but the truth. All I see when I look at you, the real is the truth. The truth is, you killed my father. I don't care who believes me. They can't reject the truth. The truth will set me free from your black stain on my life. The truth will allow me to <laughs> She's literally not listening. The world. Then I'll have won. And I'll do it without stooping to your level. Because I'm not a heartless witch like you. Whoa, whoa. What are you going to do? Kill me in plain sight? Go ahead. It would only prove everything I've said about you. Well, that and sadden the hearts of a number of young ladies. Claire, <laughs> and Trish, and Sylvia. And okay, so Trish and Sylvia, Amy, those are nods to Capcom. Trish from Devil May Cry. Um... Oh, what was the other one? Sylvia from Beautiful Joe, and Ami, which is a Machirazu from um, Okami. I'm not sure about Claire. That oh that oh duh, that's Resident Evil, RE2. So yeah, that was all Capcom women. All the femme fatales of Capcom. Nice little tidbit for there for ya. Ugh, they just get uglier for real. Fearless. Well, with a face like that. You eat this. That bad feel this. And done.
Not too shabby. Those are some blue rupees. I kind of wish on the Metroid costume they also had something like, um, like rupees. Maybe like some energy or something. Oh, come on. I hate when I get hit by stuff that's off screen. That was close. Where are you? Okay, Dracass. Uh, wait, what? No! Game, come on. That was crap. That was bullshit. I was in the middle of a torture attack. Yeah, I'm not falling for that again. That better not have counted as a death or anything. Hour of the moon has arrived. A moonlike disk visible through the crescent window. Was the moon's sudden appearance in the sky when the gears rotated just a coincidence? I think not. So the moon's very much tied into the witch's power. Oops, I did not mean to do that. Did I miss it? I think I did. That's fine. I have been falling for 30 minutes! Alright. Oh, these guys again. But oh, he got me that time. We got the full one. Oh, that hurt. Oh, you jerk. See, that's why. Wow. That's why I hate those because as soon as witch time's over, they can start just attacking you immediately. Oh, joy. Harmony. Oh! <laughs> Once again, cutscene throws me off. Oh, 
Ooh, that hurt. Get down here. Nice, another L piece of the LP. <laughs> oh, nice. The broken moon pearl. This must have been used during the training of witches. Stepping on it gives hints some sort of faint movement. Probably have to drop on it. Ooh, those th oh my I love this costume. Wow. They didn't have to add those details, but I love this costume. Even when doors open and stuff, oh my god. Like you just solved a puzzle. Oh, I love it. Thank you, Nintendo. <laughs> I now W W Link Linkonetta Leonetta. Please stop immediately. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have a sword battle. I keep forgetting to use my shield too. I just much rather use witch time. Oh, come on. Oh, come on, you're almost dead. You jerk. <laughs> he impaled me. Oh, look at that. I've been impaled. It's like the gun didn't want to finish him off. See, I feel like you only take a couple hits and bam. Oh, no wonder I was swinging so slow. I forgot I had this weapon still. <laughs> Let me dance on your back. Ooh, the chainsaw. That's brutal. <laughs> Oh, and I get to keep it for a bit. Nice. All right. Oh, 
Oh, bye bye moon, it's been covered. I need some health. Pull the lever. <laughs> That's awesome. Of course. Oh, these guys, of course. Uh, one more hit. Oh, you jerk. <laughs> they just move around too much. I think not. And you're dead. Yeah, you kind of just gotta dodge their attacks in time. Just like predict. They, they like to attack after so many hits. You can't just keep wailing on them. Ha! Right, our path forward has been opened. And how are you doing, Dave? Do you enjoy some bayonetta? Oh! Ooh, wanna grab that. I see a grave at, in the back as well. <laughs> awesome. Is that the complete LP? Yes! Um, I think those are the claws. How, I hope your matches were going well. Oh, girl. Oh, no. Oh, come on. That was bad. And that counted as a death. Wow. Oh, you jerk. Oh, game. She ate that up. She ate that. She. she okay, there we go. So stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Got that ass shot. Inspired. Well, I was definitely not inspired by all that. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, there we go. Give him a show. You get double summons. This is what you get for those cheap deaths. Oh look, my birdie wants a snack. Yum.
Bye bye, Iago. <laughs> Mama thanks you. There we go. This took a bit to pound into shape, but the workmanship's solid. Now, go put this. Yeah, claws, okay. more health. I wish they restored all my health, but oh well. Alright. Oh, another one. Why am I- why is that not giving witch time? Oh, you've... Oh. Okay, these enemies are kind of annoying. I didn't realize that it was that hard to activate witch time on them. Ugh, jerk. Die. Oh no. What is the meaning of this? This is now not once but twice. Explain this meddling of yours. The only ones meddling are your hapless minions. This will be taken care of in the manner I see fit. Your assistance is not required. I suppose coming here has given you a second wind. Feeling better, Bayonet? Who are you? And don't you dare say my long lost sister. Girl, please. No. Sorry. Next. <laughs> sister, you've quite the active imagination. You and I once fought for the jewel upon the crown of the Umbra throne. And now that you've returned, my sleeping beauty. It is time to finish that fight. Ooh. No time for daydreams. She's like, I now I remember getting impaled. <laughs> yes, bitch. She's like, my pussy's better than yours.
Another battle with Jean. Oh, the other one is in the past, I guess. Okay, so it's when you t will dodge your wicked weaves that you get witch time. Oh, that hit me. Oh, bitch. Ooh, twice. She got some good fisting on me. See, I feel like I fight better when I have more health. <laughs> What's the matter, sweetie? Afraid of something, are you? Afraid? Me? This is a waste of my time. You're still not ready. Now she's a pusser. And moths. And a bird, all in one. Bayonet is like, can I do that? While running, press ZR twice quickly and hold to unleash the beast within. Unleashing the beast within allows you to transform into an animal form and unlock mysterious magical powers. For instance, if one were to unleash the power of a panther and transform into the beast, they would be granted speed as fast as the wind and would be able to surmount even the most dangerous of cliffs with ease. I fucking gone crazy! She's like, well, fuck, I didn't know I could do that. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna go to town with this ability. <laughs> it's gonna be bad. Oof, I had a feeling. <laughs> Yes, can't wait for three. Ooh, awesome. Same. We we both can't wait for three. So kind of doing like a playthrough of one and two to get hyped for three. Um, so that's kind of what brought this whole stream about. And I'm playing with the Link costume currently, which has a lot of Zelda throw it tie-ins there so yeah um, the Nintendo Switch version which I'm currently playing it came already with some Nintendo costumes uh, there's Peach, Daisy, Samus and Link and they all have special things about them the Peach and Daisy costume throw out Bowser's fists and legs for the wicked weaves uh, Link has rupees and other noises um, you play with the Master Sword if you're using the the katana. And Samus has her arm cannon, which she uses instead of the guns. Yeah. 
Ganemba. I have no idea what she said, but okay. Oh, you jerk. Oh, he I've been impaled. <laughs> You get the heal. And finished. You love Panther mode? Yes, Panther mode is so fun. And then I got um I got the crow mode. Actually, I think we have all the animal modes now. I got the butterfly one as well to negate some damage. The surface has some beast like footprint scrawled upon it. It seems like it is some sort of switch. Like a Nintendo Switch. Is this a tie in? Wait, I think I saw something up here. Aha! Trying to hide from me, huh? That is so cute. I love that it does that. Oh, I see. Okay, I see what I have to do. And there we go. Zombie Bride. Ooh. How about Corpse Bride, too? I love Emily. She is a good character. Um, Coraline is another favorite of mine. I don't know if you would consider it a horror movie or anything. Like, it is kind of a kid's movie, but it, it definitely is creepy. Or I think they should be up there still, but I'll repost them. Oh, I hate fighting these. I mean, they're not too bad, but two at once, maybe. Okay, I think I should get down there, though. Benetta, this is your time. Oh, I missed that. Come on, I know you're gonna do something. Here we go. Lift that leg, girl. Spread those legs. Pound them. Fist them. And there's one down. Sorry, guys. I'll check the chat right now. Oh. Okay, where are you? You're inside the... Th <laughs> okay, he should be dead. I'm guessing I have to get the climax. There we go. Oh, it's the birdie. <laughs> the early bird gets the worm, and now he's going to writhe and squirm you're looking you're turning your lights off ooh <laughs> Adam's family yes that's a classic to get more pubs awesome yeah Jesse loves Adam's family as well Adam's family values um what, what was the other one I loved Debbie in the movie though the one that marries um Uncle Fester Her whole backstory just had me cackling the whole time. She was like, my parents got me, what was it, Mal Malibu Barbie? But she wanted, um, 
Oh, I can't remember the line now. She's like, they got me Malibu Barbie. That's not what I asked for. <laughs> so they had to go. And it's just like a clip of her burning the house down with her parents inside. How about hard times, Barbie? There we go. Okay, I have an interesting question for you guys. Since we're mo most of us all are, are um, queer kids. Um, did you ever play with a Barbie, like, growing up? Or ever want to? I remember I would always, like, sneak play with my sister's Barbies. Um, I, I remember the My Little Ponies. I remember Girl Talk. Do you guys remember that board game, Girl Talk? Oh my god. <laughs> Where you would talk to all the hunky guys. Only when my turtles beat them up and steal her car. <laughs> I love it. Yes, always. Oh my goodness. Pull the lever. In style. <laughs> Ooh, ride it, girl. I just love how sexual this game is. Like, I, I, everyone wants to be Bayonetta. We all want our, our inner slut to come out. Okay, they need to make like a, a gay version of Bayonetta, like have it all be a gay man, just being, but it's never going to happen. I, like to this day, I still have trouble finding games to play during like Pride Month because there's honestly not that many games that like celebrate being queer. Like y we have games that have queer characters, but like not like as a main character or like where that's what the game's kind of about you know what i mean though there is dream daddy so there's been some stuff in recent memories <laughs> oh i hate fighting these so much oh, i didn't get the witch time And the torture attacks. I love the torture attacks. Sora from Kingdom Hearts is gay? I don't know. Doesn't he... Do, I mean, I could see him being bi, but... I don't think he's gay. Doesn't he love Kyrie? I know in fan fictions they make him gay all the time because... Him and Riku. Oh, come on. I pressed, I pressed the torture attack. Oh, you jerk. Get him, girl. There's no use fighting back. I'm here to pick up all the slack. Emil from Nier's Gay? Ooh, awesome. But like, see what I want is like, not there just to be a gay character in the game. To, for it to be like, about being gay. Kinda, you know, you know what I mean? Kinda like, don't just like, shoehorn it in. Not that I'm saying all games shoehorn a gay character in there I'm just like saying you know a little more like I don't know I, ju I just feel like we 
Like, there needs to be a little more, like, ed educate people. But I guess that's what TV is for. Or maybe I just want a bear character. <laughs> But anyway... Bayonetta, though, has definitely become a gay icon herself. And I think they're dead. Vile poisonous liquid fills the area under the destroyed bridge. Trying to jump the gap while remaining in human form seems a bit dangerous. Ooh. Who doesn't want a bear character? <laughs> oh! We got some more angels here. Ooh, stomp on that ass, girl. He likes it. He likes it. You filthy slutty angel. The fact that we're beating up angels, too, in itself. <laughs> Alright. So I'm guessing I just panther mode my way over there. Alright. Alright. Let's open this door up. What are you boys doing in here? Something naughty. Are you hiding something from me? You don't want to hide things from mummy. You all need a spanking. And I'm here to deliver. Ooh, step on me, mommy. <laughs> Bish, you need a spanking. <laughs> Ooh, speaking of spanking. Naughty, naughty. Well, then you get a pistol whip. Me, me too, girl. Every time I have to deal with a child, me too. I cannot for the life of me understand why small children take so long to grow up. I think they do it deliberately, just to annoy me. Sure, Jan. She's the key to a headache. <laughs> Spread them, girl. Oh, look at her being a good mummy. I love this version of the song. And it's called Fly Me to the Moon Climax version. Stupid ketchup! Hey! Howdy, how goes Bayonetta? Going well? We're here helping poor little Cereza at the moment. Oh! I'm pretty sure I've seen you in other chats before, Ketchup, but welcome to Bear Prairie Gaming. I see it's your first time here. I am Danny. I am one half of Bear Prairie Gaming. Usually stream with my partner, but today we're playing some Bayonetta to kind of hype ourselves for Bayonetta 3. We're going to be going through Bayonetta 1 and 2. I believe we're on chapter 6 at the moment. So the question of the day that I am asking everyone is what is your favorite ho like horror slash Halloween character? Do you love a good witch? Do you love a zombie? Or is it a more particular character like Jack Skellington, Michael Myers, that type of thing? 
Bayonetta even. For me, um, I love the Sanderson sisters from Pocus Pocus. Uh, I love Coraline. And of course, love me some Bayonetta. Oh, I didn't get that which time. Please be true. My singing's terrible, but I love you. Oh, torture attack for you. You get the whip. Mommy said no. <laughs> nice, I bet you've seen me in Super Philip's chat. Yes, I think that's when I last saw you. Uh, Phil was playing some Mario Sunshine, I believe. Ask the bots to answer the question of the day. <laughs> no. They can go away. and They can sashay away. I came to slay. Your mommy is a twit. Oh, don't make Cereza cry. <laughs> the way she grabs her. <laughs> oh no, a crying ba baby cockroach would be horrible. Just imagine, oof. Fine. You've got to be a strong little one to survive all this. <laughs> <laughs> right, potential tadpole. Cereza. Cereza. She's so cute. Great, are you, little one? Where are you from? I want her little plush toy. <laughs> I'm from my house. <laughs> daddy? Ooh, is your daddy a daddy? Yeah, spill the tea, sis. What's he look like? Well, I want your daddy. <laughs> is he single? <laughs> You're gonna go with sexy ghost? Okay. Who doesn't love a sexy ghost? Now, I'll help you out of here, but that's all. No. Oh, do not pull. Do not pull the invisible ribbon. <laughs> that is not there at the moment. A single tear and you'll be crying alone. Got it? Okay, mommy. By the way, doesn't this Link costume look fabulous on Bayonetta? Oh, look at her follow us! You love being Bayonetta, Kirby, in Smash. The poses are hilarious when he does them. <laughs> yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. Okay, we're on verse 8. The next piece should be on verse 9. Oh, I can't hurt them. That's right. Get away from her, you bitch! Okay. That hurts. That's right, because we have to use like a real world object. Ah, oh, stupid ketchup! Thank you so much for the follow! <laughs> Speaking of Kirby, you got lucky, you got the Kirby follow notification. Let's give these eight bad angels a good smack. That's for giving Cereza a whack. But the fence isn't so strong that I can't break through. There we go. That's right, okay, I remember this now. You stay away from my Cereza. Ha! 
Run, Cereza, run! Mummy's got you. Or maybe not. You get off her! I said run, girl, run. Okay, now let that shit just, just mutilate her white ass and leave. Come on, run, Cereza. Use those tiny little feet. Can I get my rupees still? No, I guess not. Nobody got time for reading. This is not the library. The library is not open right now. The witch statue has been cruelly disfigured. There are signs the act was carried out by unnatural means. So we need to restore it. Paradiso. <laughs> lost to begin with. Just like a baby cockroach. Mommy. <laughs> Don't worry. It's always scary the first time you see them. So, where was I? Oh, yes. Your kind invitation. I do hope you've prepared dessert as well. Ooh, who doesn't love some desserts? Serving up something sweet, I hope. Oh, what a lovely tea party. And dancing, too. Cereza, my dear, watch and learn. <laughs> so you can grow up just to be like mummy. You get the heal! What? I feel like I was stuck for a second. That one? Don't you dare attack my Cereza. Oh goodness, not you. Ugh, the ones with baby faces, they look so creepy. No! Unhand my tiny baby cockroach! Look at her little feet! Oh! Aw, oh, see, he can't resist her charms either. I'm sorry, but she is not yours to have. Attacking his ankle here. I'm an I'm an ankle biter at the moment. <laughs> Unhand Cereza. Oh, that hurt.
And time for the climax. Avocado! Got you. You love Coraline? Ooh. Yeah, Coraline's great. The other mother was so creepy. How's Bayonetta? Bayonetta's doing well. We're on chapter 6 at the moment. Kind of just replaying Bayonetta 1 and 2 to kind of hype up to Bayonetta 3 at the moment. Ah, oh, okay. So coming this, this coming up fight is one of my favorite fights in the game. And one of my favorite cutscenes in the game, honestly. Oh, I should have jumped. Okay, I, I'm dead. <laughs> it is a bit harder than Bayo 2, but um, it's it still holds up pretty well. Ah. But like I said, there there are things in, in Bale 2 that they refined a lot more. Alright, time for the best scene ever, so... You guys are in for a show. <laughs> so Race is like, what? You're not mummy, take that. It's Dark Link. <laughs> it very well may be. Or perhaps it's Light Link. Because technically we're the Dark Link. <laughs> it's a pose off, ladies. Vogue off. <laughs> And here it comes. Oh! <laughs> yes, bitch! Yes, bitch! Yes, bitch! Yeah! <laughs> oh! Don't you try to get a cheap shot on me. No, but the best scene is coming. There's still more. Once the villain reveals herself. Here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh, this part. <laughs> oh, it's not done. The most extra entrance ever. <laughs> is, is this bitch for real? And her name is Joy. Like, girl. And let's see, wait till you see her torture attack on her. <laughs> Sorry, girl, you're done. I get my rupees. And you're done. Groba! Ba, get out, get out. How she screamed when her upper half was cut off, I have no idea. Okay, so there's the other piece of the LP. So yeah, there is one piece we missed, but it's towards the beginning, so I'm hoping I can just redo the chapter and not have to redo the whole thing. She exploded. <laughs> But I just love that in her intro, like, we have a we have a dance-off, and then she literally touches herself, and I'm just like, oh, girl. 
Like she's an angel, but she she naughty. You see all the Zelda noises because I'm wearing the Link costume. Fabulous statues. Is this where we have a boss fight? I think so. It's coming out next month. Well, actually, are we still in August? So it's, it comes out October. Yes, yeah, it looks so good. Oh, good, he can babysit her. <laughs> well, I may not have the figure. <laughs> Do I look like I have any interest in children? Just swallowing them. Making them. Well, that's another story. <laughs> See, there you go. <laughs> Wish it was payday. Ooh. When's your payday? Not right now, right? Right? Yeah, I gotta get Bayo next bonus from work. Nice. Because I knew we'd cross paths. Yeah, Bayo One is getting a physical release on no Switch. It's gonna be a limited release, but it's getting a physical re-release. I already pre-ordered it on Amazon. Oh. Comes in 5 p.m. tomorrow. Ooh. Mine should be getting shipped soon, Tim. Soon then too. I'm playing a digital version that came with Bayo Two. Don't play games with me. You've worked your magic on this poor defenseless child, haven't you? Don't assume. You're a sad, sick woman. You know that? I was her age when you killed my father. I may be sad, I may be sick, no. but it's because I love that d <laughs> Oh my god, you did, didn't you? You killed her parents. Hmm. Come to think of it. She's better off with you. I, I love how she's not even listening to what Luca's saying. She's like, no, you, you can just take care of her. Or you're going to catch hell for it. No good deed goes unpunished. And you never know when a monster may sneak up. Mummy, look out! Mummy's got it. Be back in a flash. Okay, what did he hook shot to? How can she see? Another wicked climax. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to leave a like. And if you aren't already subscribed to this bear witching channel, please remember to subscribe. And if you're looking forward to more Bayonetta content on the channel, Leave a comment below and stay tuned for more. Until next we meet. Mwah.